Hey guys, Pitmaster here. Any of you old school Kaja Kempo guys remember all of the hammer blows that we did throughout the, from white belt to black belt. So many hammer blows. I think that's uh, Kaja Kempo's go-to strike, the hammer blows. Now, one thing I've noticed about hammer blows in my training with uh, tactical pens is every, every hammer blow that you can use with your hammer fist, you can use with a tactical pen. And guess what? <laughs> it's a lot more da dangerous and deadly and effective in a real life or death situation with a tactical pen. Because you hit him in the face with a side hammer blow, you might hurt him. But if you catch him just right with a side hammer blow with a tactical pen, and you hit his eye, he's, he's done. You hit his neck, he could be done, right? You do some tight hammer blows to the face, you're gonna, you're gonna incapacitate your attacker. So it's much more effective with a tactical pen. So let me show you some basic hammer blows, and then I'm gonna show you how to make them a thousand times more deadly with a tactical pen. Blow. Side hammer blow. You can knock someone out with this, and it hurts, okay? They're on the side, boom, side hammer blow. Side hammer blow. Now I have a tactical pen, right? Some guys over here is in the airport messing with me, about to hurt me and my family. Boom, hammer blow. This time I'm kind of going for the face more, trying to hit the eyes. You hit the eyes, they're done. Hit the downward hammer blow, okay? Use that one for like collarbones or if you got someone down, you wanna hit them, hit them you know, on the ground. If you're on top of someone, the downward hammer blow is very, very effective. But in close, with a tactical pan, you can do some serious damage to the eye, okay? So the hammer blow are coming down like this now, okay? You can really damage the face with that. You can also hit right above the collarbone, you could go at a downward angle, you can go right to the carotid arteries, the throat, or even the lung. Downward hammer blow is very effective. What about the old school outward hammer blow? Remember that one? Push, push. Not very dangerous, but it's a good way to score a point. And then we had the inward outward hammer blow. Remember that one? I never really thought that was very effective, but anyway, it could be with a tactile pen. I could do the outward hammer blow right to their eyes. See, and if you got a hold on them, ooh, they're done, okay? Now you got the inward hammer blow. This one can go right to the neck, carotid artery, juggler, hammer blow, inward hammer blow. Now you do the inward, outward. What about the circular hammer blow? Remember that one? one the one where you're trying to hit him to the groin? And then you do a back fist coming up. Remember that one, guys? Boom, boom. No pen, both are gonna hurt a lot more. Watch again. To the groin, to the side of the face of the neck. Now what about the backward hammer blow? You can hit him right in the groin, really hurt. Backward hammer blow. Now with a tactical pen, you can hurt him even more. Boom, 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 boom. Get yourself a tactical pen, because when you're somewhere where you cannot carry your primary weapons, gun, knife, pepper spray, airport, airplane, some other places, a tactical pen is the next best thing. Stay safe out there, live clean, train hard, don't let anyone take your lunch money, guys. Thanks for coming.